So, I'm going to show you how I make bulletproof coffee, or at least my version of it. Uh, bulletproof coffee is um, the recipe for actual bulletproof coffee is 8 to 12 ounces of coffee, um, 1 to 2 tablespoons of grass fed butter um, or ghee, and um, 1 to 2 tablespoons of MCT oil, which I like my gut. I don't want to have to be on the toilet when drinking coffee, so I've never used that amount of um, MCT oil. Using that amount of coconut oil might you might be able to get away with, but you'll probably still have some some problems with your digestion at that point. That's a whole lot all at once. Um, if you're going to use those products, make sure you're building up to them. Um, so I start with a cup of black coffee. Um, I tend to like it made out of a French press. I put in uh, my Vitamix here. Um, I add just over a tablespoon of Kerrygold butter. I really like Kerrygold grass-fed, grass-finished. Um, it's available in most places here in the U.S. Um, I do like to get more locally made stuff, but that's me being me and me being picky. So right now I'm using Kerrygold. Now I do add a little bit of MCT oil. I would say more like a teaspoon. I don't even measure anymore and I'm almost out. but. I'd say about a teaspoon of the, of the MCT oil should be sufficient. Um, the advantages of doing this are that you get uh, the caffeine is attached to um, the fat molecules and the release into your system is a little bit um, slower so you don't get all jittery from that morning cup of black coffee. Um, so put in my blender, start it on low because it's a Vitamix, and blend it. real easy this way. You can see it's a nice creamy frothy cup of coffee. I actually enjoyed a tremendous amount. And there you have it. Again this will um, attach the fat to the coffee and it will be absorbed more appropriately for what your body can handle. Um, no more coffee jitters. Um, I like the Kerrygold butter. There's a lot more nutrient density to that than um, just coconut oil or even regular store of a lot butter. Um, I'm trying to think of what else I wanted to include in this. Oh, well, it definitely helps speed up your metabolism. Um, it feeds your it feeds your gut what it needs to, in order to continue 